Welcome back. This is still Tea Time on Plus TV Africa. They think I'm not balling, but because I don't post designer labels, holidays, and trips. And this is coming from Nigerian Hollywood actress um, Rita Dominic. So she says, happiness or balling means different things to different people. This life isn't that serious. Be happy, you're alive, and healthy first and foremost. Mm. I don't know when social media really became the yardstick. For it's been for a while. Mm. For some. Mm. For some? Yeah. Okay, someone told me that like um, two days ago. The person was like, Hi, you're just bowling, you're enjoying your job, or you're always smiling, you know, your pictures, you look so happy. And I'm like, ah, If only you if, knew. If I yours is nice, then you're a guy, they feel like it doesn't really show, is it me? Because you have makeup on, you're all made up and looking fly. I also have money. I'm mm. like, this is it comes with the job. Yeah. I have to. Yeah. Even if I cry last night, even if I cried last night, even if I cried five minutes even, ago, even my <laughs> even if the cab I entered to work, if the person slaps me, if I, whatever it could have been, I have to come here looking good and smiling for you. Like you can't base so, so people my just life look at your on social media and they just feel like, oh, that's your real life. No, come to my reality and know my real but life. I, think, I feel like it's should I tell them about your reality? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I feel okay. like it's just a human thing. Even before social media was that thing. Because I remember when I had my first Instagram account, I remember what Instagram was like. It was a strange app. Um, and even before then, we still had that thing of like the person's life looks good. Um, human beings are complicated and are, and are whatever whatever you want to call it but at the end of the day we're also very simple i don't need i don't need to take the time to analyze elsie's life what she really like is she really happy if i see on top she's pretty she looks nice i'll just make a general one minute um, impression of that Profile. and i'll yeah, not close friends yes and i'll just yeah. move on with my life and mm. i think and i think that's natural and it's okay the problem now is that um, social media has then made it even more concentrated in that idea that you can just pick things off um, people one minute. And then we know that they're doing that, so we put our best foot forward and we make sure everything is perfect and nice. And as for, uh, for her, I know where she's coming from. Because which is why, celeb sorry to cut you, which is why social media is basically the business of perception. So yeah. if you're there, they tell you to build a certain perception. Yeah. If you want to be seen as a rich kid, you can be living under the bridge that let me not exaggerate though but yeah you can be living under the bridge and create a perception of, of yourself course. being the rich kid i don't think there's days. anything wrong you with know? that there's nothing wrong with selling your brand putting your best foot forward packaging looking nice people make money off that put mm. food on their table the, the, what we need to start preaching more and I, and I think that's why i like where rita is coming from is to the consumers that listen understand what you're consuming this isn't reality it is packaged to be like that so don't then base well, too if, much if they understand it so much then the packaging might not have the correct effect it's supposed to have on them i feel like you it's still would me when i go on social media i know that this is all packaging like i look at kim kardashian's life for one especially if you watch her show and you look at her instagram it's very different because mm -hmm. when they have those talks you can see there's a mo lot more emotions a lot more vulnerable the life isn't perfect you can't get that on their social media mm -hmm. but it's still nice if i really want to be entertained and feel like wow i'm missing out on life i'll go to instagram mm -hmm. if i want to be real i'll talk to my friends or something like you just have to keep your mental health on check like don't get carried away but with what she's saying to not divert is that with celebrities we, we do like even me i'm not gonna lie we do like to base their wealth ba on, on what they show us you know and i don't think rita dominic really shows much so i'm guessing that's why she's saying what don't trip. what else do people want her to show i mean go to her page she looks good no we're not talking about looking good we're talking, we're talking about designers about cake, and trips bags, and shopping. like hawaii and the way you see you see the, 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 the of the DK yeah, that she just or, got um a new apartment and the Burj Khalifa and stuff like that. Mercy, yeah, Big Brother is a good example of somebody that yeah. really shows her wealth. Like, okay, this is the deal I've got. Well, I wouldn't say she that. shows her wealth because at the end of the day, um, it's not even guaranteed that any of the things you're showing me is even yours. And that's a different conversation. Go, but she does to... she does flaunt things, is what I'm, mm. I'm trying to say. She flaunts things. Well, well it seems she's flaunting with the EXO now. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the guy that looks <laughs> like R. Kelly. Yeah. Let's keep I mean, what is thing. it about that guy? Because everybody, yes, I know I do the whole Amebo thing with my gang and my friends. <laughs> so everybody I shared that, um, um, is a video now yeah. too. The first question they ask is, what does Willie Exo do? Mm. So have you noticed that the perception around him is basically the fact that he looks like Al Kelly? Nothing mm. else. I myself don't even know. It's really? Yeah, that's what he is. It's a Where's the song? Early in the morning. 
I'll even know his song. Ah. I'm joking. Willie X was a good singer. I mean, um, which is why when people try to create some publicity stunt around themselves, they really should be careful. Because right. sometimes you just you become, that, you become, that you become that stunt, something yeah. you do you were not planning to yeah. become. Trust me, this came from at least six people yesterday, and I also had to pause to think. Okay, what does it do? Mm. Like, okay, yeah. And I, I said, Sorry. "He's the guy that looks like Alkeli." That's all. <laughs> Anyway, except you want to add more to that. Um, well, social media is not the truth. And um, just define your truth by your own self. It's mm -hmm. what you're feeling, your happiness. That's the most important thing. It's mm -hmm. not what you're showing people. It's not about people's perception. Because uh, people can be easily deceived and carried away by right. all this material stuff. And I would say, don't make, don't live your life for the gram. Basically, yeah. everything, you wake up in the morning, you're not enjoying, you're not living, you're mm -hmm. just thinking of how to get the best picture for the gram. Where are you going to post for the gram? Like, yeah. you're just not relevant to yourself than mm. just to create that content for the yeah. gram. So just try to leave and post the very little moments on Instagram. It's not that deep. And it's cool to keep mystery. It's nice. I feel mm -hmm. like it's better when we don't and really cool know what's happening. And it's cool to have a private life. Yeah.